Hello there, in this tutorial I'm going to discuss about uh, using additional mail and providing uh, additional mail rights to a user in Exchange server. So uh, basically what is the requirement of giving the additional mail? Uh, for example, in, a, in an organization, in, in a small organization you have only one or two big directors out there. So directors have uh, options where uh, they can they can uh, get the uh, or they can they can connect with the uh, users of that uh, or maybe if they're serving any clients so uh, they can directly connect with the company so it's like that for example a customer always feel that uh, uh, giving a mail or sending mail to higher authority will help them to work uh, or to help them to solve the issue more efficiently and fluently uh, 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 in, a, in a short form of time rather than uh, go with the normal process so that's why you find the higher authority mails are always been uh, uh, been there now, for example how to do that in exchange server if i have a user call under that tank engineer tv dot in and if i wants to assign another additional mail now that's anirudh already have the mail id which is called anirudh at tech engineer tv dot in now for example uh, any ceo of the company was taking care of the existing mail or were not even uh, made of ceo for example they just made a uh, the the mail id or if under for temporary basis or if under for permanent basis wants to see up the ceo mail as well to get connected with the public maybe an error that tech engineer tv dot in is using using for for private conversation with the company's employee if they wants to connect with the uh, public then he can get additional so go to the properties go to the email addresses in the tab you can see email addresses and then you can see that already one email id has been assigned now you can add more by going to the add button and for example you want to give ceo at tech engineer tv dot in this is uh, the mail id uh, you want to uh, uh, have that for example if, if under and if i'm assigning the separate mail id to enter then he can he can check and he will get the mail uh, with that additional mail id as well so i have just applied it okay and two mail ID has been now assigned to the user and in the exchange server. I just press a OK there. Now I'm going to do the uh, mailbox and try to send a mail to uh, CEO at Tech Engineer TV. And I'm going to uh, log in with Android's uh, credential, log in with the Android's account. So. I'm just uh, logging with for example the user is Simon King I give up email ID and uh, then the password the login ID of Simon King Now I'm going to send a new mail. And we'll send a mail to CEO at Tech Engineer TV dot in. Now the subject. and the mail self and send a mail 
to see you now you can see the sender will be changed no matter we have sent a mail to CEO but the sender has been changed and it become Android because the primary will be remain same it's like the gateway it become a gateway uh, to send a mail to Android for example you're not aware of that that Android is taking care of it or if you are if you have some other member of CEO line and and if Android taking care of the for the temporary basis then uh, the mail will be sent to Android because it has been now signed to Android and these are the mails are uh, common mails and not one person basically uh, uh, used those only one person is not so it all the time uh, it's it's considered as uh, it's 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 considered as a official mail and not one person basically owns that so anyone who get the designation of CEO or MD chairman anything uh, in a higher post uh, will start or will be authorized to have that mail ID so basically that is not a private uh, it will it's have their their all emails as well who server was taking care of the company so this is like that we just assign the mail id uh, uh, to the company head who server it is so i'm just logging with the android credential now this android mail will be will be of android now for example if uh, a mail sent to android will be will be of android but uh, the CEO mail whosoever send a mail to CEO will be of CEO it's like that so it will be direct right gateway the CEO mail is routed to to Android the the mail of Android so I'm just open uh, first time logging this browser that's why asking uh, the time zone languages and all that okay so you can see the one unread mail i have received there is unread mail so i just need to open it and you can see it's urgently need attention urgently wants to meet on some issues simon king has sent a mail to ceo at tech engineer tv dot in but it has been uh, received by android because the tech engineer tv dot in has been assigned to android uh, whosoever the group had is uh, or whosoever for example account head or ceo or something like that has been given to that line so hope you learned something from it thank